Good morning, Frey. Here are the notes on the Tirana I promised you. <sighs> Look, about our deal. Your dad's journals all got burnt up in the guild when we escaped. It's fine. Frey, you brought him back. That's far more important. That is more than I could ever have hoped for. Here. Thank you. <laughs> so, uh, where can I find Sila? You should visit the Archives in Upper Sapor. You'll be able to find out more about her there. The Archives. Got it. Alden, sorry to bother you, but I just saw your father wandering off. Uh, forgive me, Frey. I need to go and find him. <laughs> Right. Off to the Archives we go. I am kind of worried about Bob, though. He is my ticket out of here. <sighs> Do what you want. But remember, we have a Tunta to defeat. You're free, aren't you? They want to use their amazing powers to drive back the monsters. I'm Pilo. Can't believe I'm talking to the hero who saved the city. I'm not a hero. Not now, never will be. Did you want something? Um, just wondering if there's anything I can do. I don't know, I could... Hey, I could show you around town. You haven't been here long, right? A guided tour, what an excellent idea. Certainly couldn't hurt to get the lay no, of the land. No, thanks, but I'm not in the mood. Oh, don't say that! Look, I'll be waiting for you, all right? When you're ready, just let me know. Decided to take me up on my offer? Okay, bet. Give me the tour. Great! This is great! All right. We'll start at the square in the lower city. This way. Come on, follow me! The lower city is where all the refugees live. And the square, here, is its heart. Are you a refugee? My parents were. I was born here. Sepal are born and bred, huh? Anyone my age or younger pretty much has to be. Interested in these here books, are you? You've got a good eye. They're treasures of a sort, all rescued from the abandoned Cognizance guilds. Oh, cool. Hey, this one actually looks useful. It's about crafting. It certainly seems like it might be worth your while. I'd be happy to give it to you. For a price. I collect old things, see? Find some and I might just be persuadable. What about this old coin? Well now, isn't that a beauty? I'll need more than one of those, depending on the book, but here, have a look. Anything take your fancy? Nice doing business with you. Ask 
Bob about those Tyrannas. Your young Olivia's friend. Ella, this is the girl Olivia was talking about. The, the amazing girl? Oh, come on. I wouldn't go that far. Olivia used to look after my Ella for a lot, you know. But I never heard her talk about another grown-up like she did you. You must have been very special to her. You think so? Well, she was special to you too, I imagine. She never knew her parents, you know. They left her at a dump when she was just a baby. What? You're kidding. It's no wonder she found it so hard to trust adults. Felt safe offending for herself. I never knew. Tanta Sila was a mighty warrior. I'd watch yourself out there if I were you. I was just pondering the fleeting nature of life. One moment, we are laughing together, not a care in the world. The next, we are naught but dust on the wind. What good can come of love in such a time? Surely it can only end in tragedy. I hate to say it, but you might be right. Some music, perhaps? Though I fear it will do precious little to lift the mood. Then allow me to perform the horrible terror of Praenost. He really needs some help. Praenost is a harsh and unforgiving. Not all. And for those you they would do. Not exactly the most illuminating of ditties, was it? That's the trouble with these arty types. Very little in the way of practical advice. What do you mean? Kranos bad. Stay away. That was pretty much the message, right? Shall we? Arden's over the moon to have her father back. I don't think I've ever seen her so happy. I say we owe you a thank you. Around here is basically a turf. A shame it's barely fit for human habitation. Do the buildings around here just not get fixed? Sometimes. But we're not a priority down here. The upper city comes first. And that, and then everything else. That sucks. Up there is where we get our water. Uh, I've seen that already. Thank you, though. Oh, really? All right, then. Let me show you something else. frightening it is. Fancy letting someone like that roam the streets unsupervised. Hey, Mommy! Mommy! That's the lady! Shush you! And you don't go near her! You hear? Hey! That's no way to! It's cool. I'm used to it. True. I was rather hoping to see that fiery temper of yours in action. Petty small-minded gossips! Although, 
I suppose it is pretty frightening. With your power, you could turn the whole town on its head just like that. Yeah. You're something else, all right. Not this shit again. I'm nobody. Get over it already. Hey! Do you like animals? They're all right, I guess. Great! You like this, then? Over here is where we keep all the livestock. We don't get to eat meat very often, but we do all right, I suppose. Hey, you can't create food out of thin air, can you? Never mind. The big open area is the graveyard. Rich or poor, we all end up there in the end. A farm and a cemetery. You don't see that often. Really? It's quite a good arrangement. The animals help keep the grass down. Come on. Let's go and take a closer look. <laughs> They're not shy, that's for sure. Well, we don't get many new faces in town. Hey, why don't you try feeding them? Really? Is that allowed? Of course! Wait here! I'll go and grab some food. Just go up to one of them, and hold out your hand. This guy's a mess. You don't bathe them? Oh, we try. But that one just loves his mud baths. Like I said, this is the graveyard. There's so many of them. Yeah, well, if they're dead, they're down there. Damn, you really wolfed that down, huh? Our savior's favorite farm. That's kind of a ring to it. 
Don't you think? I might put up a sign. Right! I suppose it's time I showed you the upper city. It's back the way we came, and up the stairs. Or did you want to look around a bit more first? Can I ask you something? Your powers? Could you give me a quick demonstration? Absolutely not. You're not some street performer. Look, I'm sorry, but they're not for show. Ah, really? I was hoping you'd give me another look. But I guess I've seen enough. Adi is as good as safe already. How many fucking times do I have to tell you? I'm not your savior. So, this is where the rich folks live. Yep. And they get the best food, the nicest clothes, and the safest part of the city to themselves. They get to run everything just because of who they are. Best not to think about it. Ah, oh, the accident of birth. Curse you, cruel fate. It's her. Oh. Don't even look at her. What business does someone like that have in this part of the city? Uh, that boy is here again. Ignore him. He'll clear off soon enough. Do you want me to call the guards? Only if she does something. Well, of course she will. We'll see, dear. We'll see. This is the Tower of... Oh, sorry. I forgot. Hey, uh, don't worry about it. Let's maybe not go in for the full tour, though. Hey there. The cats in the upper city certainly aren't afraid of anyone, are they? Yeah, they're cute. They're not Homer. I don't know how you even tell one from another, to be honest. Don't you really trust it? It's not This is the mausoleum. Our souls come here when we die. What are you doing here? And you? You belong in the lower city. Yes! You have no right to be here. Neither of you. Be gone! Ugh, of all the people to run into. Frey saved the city! If anyone deserves to be here, it's her! If she wanted, she could turn you to ashes in a heartbeat! But she'd never do that. Isn't that right, Frey? Okay, can you fucking let it go already? What? What's wrong with you all of a sudden? If you want to save your city, do it your fucking self. You're not dragging me into this. What about our tour? There's so much still to see. I don't need a stupid fucking tour. You're not really going after Tanta Sila, are you? Suppose it's better than you loitering around town any longer. You're 
you're the criminal who came from the corruption, aren't you? Well, stay out of the upper city. <laughs> Look at him. He looks like he's standing guard. That, or he's still petrified after everything that's happened. Please, Ray, wait! Listen, okay? I never said I'd help you. With anything. Ever. Got that? I... I'm sorry! I just... I got carried away, I suppose. Look! Let me take you to one last place. Fuck no! Come on, please! I'm not sure he's gonna take no for an answer. <sighs> one look at whatever the hell it is, and I'm out. Thank you so, so much! Come on! It's this way! Wait, wh what the hell is this? Thank you so much for saving the city! Well, Mom said we're not supposed to talk to you, but, but you helped us. Thank you, Frey. They've been wanting so badly to show you how grateful they are. Uh, I... it was nothing. That's not true. And you know it. We're all in your debt. Me included. Wait, is... is this why you came and found me in the first place? Pilo! You better not let me find you slacking off, you little runt. Oh, no! Where the heck are you? Get here! Now! Oh, no! It's the boss! Sorry, Frey. I've got to go. What an excitable young man. You know, I've never gotten flowers before. And let's hope it never happens again, shall we? Thank you, Ray! Really, thank you! I'm so happy the crops weren't ruined. And my dad said if we didn't have any grain, we'd all starve to death. Please, you've got to stop this at once. Sounds like I'm trouble. so happy the crops weren't ruined. And my dad said if we didn't have any grain, we'd all starve to death. Yo, what's going on here? The Robian's trying to desecrate a lovely old ballow tree. He's, uh, got himself a mind worked up. You, Blue, and the Bloomers too! We tried to explain to him that he can't just run amok in the grove like this. That there is our last ballow. All right, just cut him some slack, okay? He's been living in the break for the past 20 years. He's just taking some time to adjust. He'll be back to himself soon. Mm. You keep telling yourself that. Father! It's Odin. Odin? 
Marty, my new girl. What are you doing here? I was supposed to see you there. I cannot see you there. If you are here. It's all right. I will take you there, and we will be there together. Apologies. Oh! Be a good man, Sir Robian, and hand it over. Please, Father, give it to them. Please. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. We'll take it from here. Just make sure that he doesn't. He won't. You have my word. Oh, God. I'm such a fool. You are no fool. I believe in you. I told them you wouldn't harm the tree, but I never said that I wouldn't. Now is our chance. Once again, breaking the law. I don't do it proudly. But all I do is for Athia. And if my father believes this could help, then I believe it too. Hey, Bob. Strange young girl from another world. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, have your notes on the portals. The Tirana? Who am I? He's much worse than I believed. Forgive me. My mind's a, a, a little wibbly wobbly, wobbly wibbly. Um, Vush? Huh? Vush? 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 <laughs> yes, Vush! I need a Vush back home, where I came from, after I killed this crazy lady. I survive. You will. I will go back home, or I will kill the crazy lady. One or the other. Maybe both. Maybe neither. Ugh. Who's to know? Sounds promising. <laughs> yes. Yes, yes, I promise. I will work on making you voice. You have my word. Mm, terrific. The word of a senile old has been. I am clad. Great. What am I doing in the grove? Let's get you home. Audi! Yes. Sir. Come on. I'll catch you guys later. Hey, Cuff. Speaking of Bob, how come he didn't turn into a zombie? He came right through the break with us. I'd say he was mostly break zombie already, wouldn't you? Strange how Auden seems to love Bob so much. Strange? Why? Well, I don't exactly think the world of my parents. I guess being left on your own for years doesn't hit everybody the same way. But why should it? Humans are horrendously complex creatures, after all. Olivia. Barely knew the kid, but she just stuck with me. She had fire. And now it's been extinguished. Somebody has to pay. Let us proceed to the archives, then. What's with this weird tree? Interestingly, I don't think it looks like that because of the break. This blue glow. What's that about? The essence of life distilled, if some are to be believed.
Don't you think we'd better learn more about Scylla before charging off into the wilds? It's about Serobian. I... Actually, it's about everything. The city, too. We... We owe you our thanks. Had you not been here, who knows how many more would have suffered? I... could have done more. Please. I know you are in pain. But you must not lose heart. The bard at the square, Wallace. Do you know him? He may be a frivolous, nonsensical sort of person, but his talent is undeniable. Perhaps a tune might do you good. Truly, his music has the power to soothe the soul. <sighs> Wait, you're not telling me she's... Really? That foppish nonsense? No, no. Of course not. My feelings are not... I... I mean, of course I... Oh, never mind. His music gives me a certain courage, that's all. A sense that it may not be altogether foolish to hope for a brighter tomorrow. Well, I guess I'll have to listen harder. You plan to face Tantasyla, do you not? Those of my line have long been her most faithful protectors, though such a legacy is no longer one to speak of with pride. Take care. She is not to be trifled with. The dutiful sword maiden and the foppish bard, eh? What a pair. Yeah, it's like the plot of a corny romance novel. leave the city yet. How are we to defeat an enemy we know nothing of? Huh. So these are the archives. What is this? And who are you? I'm the archivist. Auden, tell me you were clever. How do you not know what a book is? No, I know what a book is. Ah, 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 ah. You don't look like an archivist. You don't look like a hero. That's because I'm not. I used to be a blacksmith before. Built weapons for the very woman that raided our city. She and I were quite close. She trusted me, and I trusted her. Sorry. No matter, it was another time. She was another woman, as was I. <laughs> Keep up! Is everybody in this town batshit crazy? Okay, so how do you go from a blacksmith to a librarian? Archivist! And a smart woman knows when to shift her purpose for the needs of her people. Catch! What is this? It's the floor plan of Silas Castle. Uh, what are you, my fairy godmother? <laughs> <sighs> name's Johidi. You're the one that's planning on facing off with Sila. Well, the name's Frey, and it sounds like you don't think I'm up to the task. Tanta Sila is the strongest and most formidable of all the Tantas. She controlled the army. Crushing the weak, even without the weapons that I forged for her. Crushing them. 
with her bare hands. I'm beginning to have second thoughts about this. This batty old harridan needs to shut her mouth. You will be doing our land a great service by killing her. Rid us of Tanta Sila, and the corruption in her realm will stop spreading. <laughs> but no. I doubt you'll actually succeed. Before you go, I would suggest that you learn all that you can about the Tantas. The archives, full of books about them. Definitely not my fairy godmother. So they used to rule Athia, and people used to like them. Yes, although you'd never guess that now. You're here to read, you say? Oh, I, I'm sorry, it's just no one in Sipal has any interest in books these days. Can't say I envy these people. Their rulers did some super fucked up shit. I doubt many of them would disagree. Let's see. A study of miracles. It appears to be an in-depth analysis of what makes the Tantas' magic so powerful. I wonder if you might learn something from it. Pick up some tips and tricks for your own magic, perhaps. Yeah, maybe. I could use the help. I think more than a few of their former subjects came to wonder the same thing. That thing we read, it was written by the first ever Tanta. And it sounds like there might still be more of them to find. Wouldn't hurt to learn more. Guess we could keep an eye out. So, the Tantas had superpowers that they used to keep Athia safe. And the people loved them for it, worshipped them. Instead of protecting the people, they started making them suffer. And then the break appeared. An admirably pithy pricey. But it doesn't make any sense. Why would they just go crazy like that? That's enough for now. Think I'm pretty clued up on the Tanta basics. Then I suggest we depart. <laughs> 